Hey everybody, figured I'd give a little channel update. Uh, got a new motor the other day. Kind of built one. If you've watched and seen the little six horse deal on the end of the other video, ta da! Improved. What I did, I took that six horse off because it just wasn't enough motor. And we got a 12 horse Briggs on here. And I've got the gas tank set up. Yeah, I had a little mishap with the gas room, my paint job. But anyway, I said, got it mounted. Looks real nice, real slick, low profile, gravity feeds in, but we've got everything finished and got the 12, this is a 12 and a half horse Briggs on there. You can see the Lovejoy set up and I've got my shifter hooked up now. So forward, you know, neutral, reverse, it's all there. All that's good. So we got forward and reverse and this is, you know, Kind of a pro drive setup, pretty much, you know. Or closer comparison, be like a Mud Buddy Sport V, just homemade version. And like I said, I got forward and reverse, outboard leg, and you know, four stroke air cooled mud motor, everything you ever wanted. And pretty cheap to build, you know. Probably got a hundred bucks in this thing with parts and everything. And don't freak out, I still have the Mud Skipper surface drive, and I'm gonna fix it. But I am very unhappy with that transom deal. It's tore this boat up. I don't like it. And I'm going to improve on it. And that will probably be this winter when I get some downtime. So it's going to be a while. But we're going to do some fishing videos with this thing. And it's ready to go. And what... I like that surface drive. Don't get me wrong. But I did not like the bracket on it. And I'm going to make it adjustable and put it on, you know, a regular transom style like this where you can put it on and then adjust it to where I can move it up and down on the muskipper surface drive but we've got this and we're going to use this and I am just thrilled to death with this setup I had I've actually got some old videos on my other channel and I might resurrect them and pull them out and make a quick fishing clip video and put on this fishing channel here but I actually had a factory built one of these, the Chinese ones you can find, but it was a long shaft. And then it was a six horse as well. It worked good on the little bitty boat with one person, but two, it just wasn't enough power. Same problem I had with the one I built, except I didn't, with the long shaft, I had to make a tall bracket to make the transom height work, you know, down here with the boat. And it was really stupid looking. I might try to find that old video so you'll know what I'm talking about and some random fishing clips but back to the subject this is done we're rolling and we're going to take this out to the lake so like i said this is i'm thrilled to death with this setup and i'm still going to fix the mud skipper surface drive but it's probably going to be a while but more fishing videos coming and hold on if you can get there yep. Yeah, my starter's been giving me fits. Hang on just a second and I'll start it up. I've been, I've got a new starter on the way. This was the only one I had on the place. The gear's all messed up on it, but give me just a second. Now, I just gotta take it off and move it a little bit and it'll start. So hang on, bear with me. All right, we're back. Move the gear a little bit, should start now. How about that? Working good. Like I said, I'm quite happy with this. And kill. Like I said, push button start, push button kill. No keys, didn't want them, didn't want to mess with them. And like I said, I do have a new starter coming. This one still works, but the gear's all messed up. All I gotta do is just turn it a little bit and it works. But it usually don't give me very much problem, very seldom, but it it did then. But anyways, like I said, got a new starter coming, I'm gonna put on it, so not a big deal. But I thought everybody would like this, you know? This channel's pretty well based off mud motor stuff, so we still got one. And like I said, this is kind of a pro drive style, or a real close one would be like the Mud Buddy Sport V. They're just a homemade poor boy version. <laughs> Franken build, lawn board engine. I call them so I know everybody might thought or at least I thought everybody would find that interesting so of course you want to see it in action so let's go to the lake and take it for a test drive see you there
Hey everybody, made it to the lake. So we're gonna take a little run. I'm not gonna go wild, old motor's kinda. Take a little more, been set. Sound better on the lawnmower, but anyway, we're out on the lake going, so. It is a moving. So we'll just take a nice little, little run about. Show you we are on the lake. Don't keep it right there and idle seems to work pretty good. But it is working when you're on the lake, so we're going fishing now, so we're going to take a little river right here. Anyway, nice day on the lake. right along, turn like a kitten. Does that real good. Did a little tweaking and tuning, we'll have it. Hey, we're out on the lake. Everything is just beautiful. Up here in this little cove, checking everything out. So. Take a little run, see what's up. At the end of the road. But anyway, all right. Well, there it is, folks. Made a little run. Like I said, I got a little tweaking and tuning to do, but nothing major. I'll try to get everything lined out. And as I said, maiden voyage. We're out on the lake. There's always some problems, especially when you build something. So a little tweaking and tuning, we'll have it. No, I ain't too worried. Definitely going to start fishing some more. I just love being out here. So, anyways. So that's it. So if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. I'll catch you on next video.